I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Yes, I look, I look a mess. I look a mess. I know I do. I had a rough weekend. Was not feeling good at all. But then I get this notification saying from YouTube telling me that I have reached 1,000 subscribers. OMG, 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 OMG. Y'all, we did it. The Real McCoy Gang is now officially at 1,000, I think, 1,008, which is just such an honor, such an honor. Thank you guys so much. Thank you all for helping me out. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you guys for watching the do's and the don'ts. I hope I taught y'all what to do and say, mm, don't do that. Just thank y'all. Thank y'all. Um, I'm going to jump right into this because it's late. Yeah. D don't judge a book by its cover, honey, because this, this, this was late. Do you hear me? This was late. But right now it's unlaid. The, but the curls and the definition that I got from it when I did it is what inspired me to do this video. So, first of all, I'm going to start off backwards. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do to apply, which products I'm going to be using to apply to my hair to get these twists going. And so deeply, look, if you can just see how deeply defined it is and I love it because it it was totally it didn't had a rough past three days rough but the definition stuff is still there so we're gonna do it again but I'm gonna do it with y'all so the um, LCO method because I am low porosity it's gonna be the Blue Magic Tea Tree Oil. And this is the anti-breakage protein. Yes, protein complex. So this is a non-greasy. It does not have um, a lot of petroleum in it. It has petroleum in it, but it's water-based. The first product in here is water. So this is gonna be the leave-in that we're gonna be using. And the cream that we're going to be using is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter and Biotin Length Retention Style and Nectar. This is like a gel, but not really. You don't have no crunch. Actually, it's a zero crunch weightless definition gel, and it's color safe. I've used this before. I think, no, I know I made a video using this before, but I use it as a wash and go. But this time it's gonna be used for flat twist and twist. And then we're gonna seal it all in with the Blue Magic Super Sure Grow. I love this stuff. It actually has the herbs and everything already in there. And I don't mind, I don't mind herbs, I, I, I don't mind. I don't mind the herbs at all. Okay. But anywho, over the holidays, I have found um, OGX, which is totally new for me. It's sulfate free. And it is a charcoal, it's a purifying and charcoal detox shampoo and conditioner and i am looking for healthy ways to remove the grease from my hair without totally stripping my hair and this here it says purify your pretty strands with this clarifying blend 
infused with coconut, coconut, charcoal, and kaolin. I think it's kaolin. Yes. Kaolin clay. Burst through buildup and residue congested stresses for a deep clean. No stripping here. The blend leaves shine. So I'm going to use this as my clarifying shampoo and conditioner. And when I get out of the shower, because y'all know I do not take y'all in the shower with me. Has a very pleasant smell. Very pleasant smell. Consistency is thick. It is thick. But I will let you know about the, the slip and all that kind of stuff once I finish shampooing and conditioning my hair. So I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I have shampooed and conditioned my hair. I'm going to be telling you about that. I have also made a tweak to... The nectar, I'm not going to be using the nectar because the nectar does not pair well with my um, leave-in from Blue Magic. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so tired. The nectar did not pair as well with the leave-in from my Blue Magic. So since I'm going to be using Blue Magic as a sealant as well, I went on and I rinsed that back part out because I've already twisted up my hair. I rinsed that back part out because I just got started and put back in my leave-in and we're just gonna go ahead and just use the Extreme Wet Line Gel. So that's the combination that I've been using. So I've, I have the leave-in in and then I put, I'm putting in the Extreme Wet Line Gel and I'm sealing it with my uh, Blue Magic Super Sure Grow. I just did not, I, 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 I could have because I have Palmer's Grease. I have Palmer's Grease, but I didn't want to do Palmer's. I, I just wanted to do Blue Magic. So this works well with me. All is well, all is well, all is well. Anywho, this here, shampoo and conditioner, it's the bomb, but there's a catch. This here, it is it, definitely, it say no strip in here. This blend leaves shine. All that is true. But when I tell you it busts through any type, any type of buildup you got going on in your hair, it takes it out. It takes it out. It is a good cleansing, cleansing, cleansing shampoo. It is. And my hair felt completely stripped until I went in and I put in the conditioner. Now, once the conditioner was in and I worked in my hair and combed through my hair and everything, I started to smell like a like a chemical smell. Like I'm like, oh shit. Is this a perm? What is what what's going on? I'm starting to smell something. Then I had to keep in mind that it is a detox. So it was, I guess it was deeply getting to the strands of my hair and it was pulling everything out. Because once I rinsed it out, my hair was soft, manageable. So it did its job. Now, is that this this shampoo something that I would recommend? that you can use on a daily basis like I would use my Biotene Boost by Hask? No. No. If you want a good deep clean once, twice a week, if you want to use that shampoo and conditioner, that'd be good. That'd be good. But since I am using grease in my hair now, I do have to make sure I get everything good and clean before I start on another hairstyle. So it did it. It did it. But it just, I was like, what is this? What, what, what is this smell? What is that? What? Now, all over my hair, 
um, my combination of my wild growth oil and my black castor oil, which is in here, all is all already all over my scalp. The leave-in conditioner is all over my head. All those steps have been done. So what I'm going to do now is just see if I want to flat twist. I think I want to flat twist this whole little section, but I may just leave these here as twists. So I'm going to go ahead and add my gel. And guys, look at that. Look, look how much my hair has grown. Oh. Ah, that's why I say the hair will grow. It's retaining the length that's important. That's why you got to take care of those ends. Take care of your hair. Take care of your hair strands. Take care of your scalp. I never shampoo my hair without using my scalp massager and waking up the blood in my scalp and all that. I never shampoo my hair without using it. Never. It's just things you have to do. You have to take care of the scalp. You have to take care of your hair. Now I'm going to put it in the grease. You have to take care of the scalp. You have to take care of your hair. You have to take care of the ends of your hair. Take care of your roots. Just take care of it all. And it pays off. It pays off. Because I just colored my hair, I think about a month ago. And my hair has grown that much. So, I know you see it. I know you see it. I'm really in debate if I want to flat twist this.
I put the rollers in because nine times out of 10, 10 times out of 10, I'm not gonna take it down tomorrow. I usually like to wait a couple of days. Let it sink in real good, let all the moisture get in, uh, go back in a couple of times, go down my scalp, um, put my oil in, you know, just to make sure the oils are in there and my scalp is taken care of. So there are different things that I do. I don't just not take down my hair. There are reasons that I don't take down my hair. For one, I want to make sure my hair is 100% dry. And I do not like to sit under a hair dryer. I don't like it. I don't like the heat. So I'll let this sit, take the rollers down in the morning. And after I tie it up tonight, all this will be then soaked in my hair. That's all you see is uh, the grease, the blue magic. That's what you're seeing here with the leave-in and the, and the gel. So all that to me is just moisture. So it will, it'll be gone in the morning, but it lets me know. And I feel good just knowing that it's there. It's there. So I will see you guys for the takedown. Um, realistically, day two cyber world <laughs> the next clip gosh i love cyber world all right go ahead and subscribe that's very important make sure you click on the notification bell and select all because i'm very random i don't have a certain date that i put out videos not just as of yet Right now, if I have something that I want to share with you guys, I just share it. And I record and I get it out there, I edit it, and I get it to you. That's just how I do it. So, um, just select the all button and become a part of the family. All right? So, once again, don't forget to subscribe. We're over a thousand subscribers, y'all. That's like music to my heart. Guys, once again, keep God first in everything you do, and I do mean everything, and I'll see y'all in the next part for the takedown. All right, bye. All right, guys, it is time for the takedown. It has been two days later. Two days later, hair is still intact. And I'm going to add some oil to my hand. I actually found this little piece here that I left out. But it's still hanging on in there. So I'm going to add some oil to my hands. I'm going to speed up the video. And I am going to take my hair down. And I'm rubbing the oil in the direction of the hair. Now, I did use this. Uh, last night and went back over my scalp and everything so my hair is already oiled but I have to take it down and try to prevent some free frizz and as normal I'm running a little behind so good morning and let's start the video. Let's.
concludes this video. As you can see, I have a whole lot of definition. A whole lot of definition. And I'm going to let it be because over the days, it's going to get fluffier and fluffier and fluffier. And I'm just not going to bother it. So make sure you check out my Instagram, the Real McCoy 411 And a recap, the leave-in by Blue Magic. And I use the Blue Magic Super Sure Grow as my sealant. And I even put a little extreme wet line gel in there because the nectar by Palmer's seems to only work with the nectar hair grease and I wasn't using that. So here we go. I know you see it. So that's a lot of definition. Um, I could go through and pull them apart. But I'm not going to. I'm not going to because I like this definition. So I'm going to leave it just like it is. And I wish I could do something with this middle part. But I can't. And I don't want to create no frizz. So since I can't. I'm going to put it over this way. And just put me a bobby pin at the top to hold it going in that direction. Or I could have did a bobby pin in the front to keep it going in that direction. And that's what I did. So, see here? Starting to create fridge. Don't want that. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Give me comments. Let me know if you're starting to put hair grease back into your hair regimen. It's working. And it's working just fine. And my scalp feels good. And my hair feels good. Everything feels good. Um, so, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And feel free to share the video. We need more views. We need more views. So... I will catch you guys on the next one. And remember to keep God first in everything you do. And I do mean everything. All right. As I go to work today, I'm keeping God first in everything I do. As that my feet hit the ground in the morning, I'm keeping God first in everything that I do. So God bless you all. And I'll see you on the next video.